Hey there, Chad Bonds, you're here for Ohio University Libraries. I currently have several hundred business students who are researching the ice cream industry. In particular, they have to build their own business concept or come up with their own business plan for a company in that industry. In this video, I'll show you how to use BizMiner to understand local industry conditions for the specific industry. Here you go. When we first arrive at BizMiner, what we're gonna do, we're gonna go into the industry market profile. I've got a separate video on how to use the industry financial profiles, but for now we're going to look at the industry market profiles. Once we're in this area here, first you have to select your industry. And to do so, you can do a keyword search. For my search, I'm going to search for ice cream. And you can do a search there and hit the hourglass or just hit enter. And this will pull up all the keyword terms that are associated with that industry. I'm interested in particular in look at ice cream parlors. So I'm going to choose this industry and this industry code down here at the bottom. And you can see that will populate it down here in our industry market profile. I need to now select a market area. So I'm going to go and choose a select market. And you can go in here and search by county, by zip code. Uh, for my example, I'm just going to click on the state and kind of show you what kind of information is available that you can see from the browsing context. So I'm going to click on Ohio here. And this will take a minute to load, but what this will do is actually populate all of the available uh, zip codes and counties and cities that are available within the BizMiner data set. Once that loads, you can see BizMiner is organized by metro areas, by counties, by zip codes. And if we scroll down, we get all kinds of information that we can look for for, uh, for the, the local area. For my example, I will choose Franklin, Ohio as the county. And then once I do that, it will do an analysis and tell me that there are 67 operations in that area. And I just simply have to click access now and then access now one more time to retrieve the data for um, for Franklin County. Now, you'll notice up in the top right hand corner, it's taking a little bit to load. It's going to actually load that live. So it may take a couple minutes to actually load the data for you. Uh, once these buttons are filled in, you will you'll then be able to access the information on the left hand side of the page. Once the data says it's loaded, we can then go over here on the left hand side and look at information. I particularly like to start looking at the competitor section. The competitors tab has a nice map of the region as well as on the left hand side you can see the names of some of the com companies that are in the industry. So if we look at one it will give you the sales bracket and classification, um, the website for the company as well as you know uh, more information about the company. It doesn't give specific sales information but it gives you a good idea about who some of the key competitors are. Uh, likewise, you can go over here and look at the annual industry sales. You can also look at things like startup information, how much uh, the, the total market share for startup companies in the industry in the local market, as well as cessation, uh, numbers of, of companies uh, that have gone out of business over a certain period of time. So it's a great way to kind of get an overall look at how a particular industry is doing in a location. Hopefully this video helped you understand how to use BizMiner to understand local industry conditions. Should you need more help, check out my business guides. Take care.